This is microphone holes. And this is webcam. I use cameras from all laptops for my DIY projects. For example, to monitor 3D printer progress, but not from newer old laptops. Let me explain. On very old laptops, you can just take web camera and solder USB port. A challenge is only to find plus and minus and USB data cable. USB data cable uh, mostly will be twisted pair. It's also easy with old microphones from old laptops. Traditional analog microphone, you need to connect only two cables. This is microphone from old laptop. Here is audio cable. I soldered two cables here. Testing, testing, one, two, three. But newer microphones and web cameras are on small PCBs. Let me disassemble one old laptop. Under microscope, right microphone, LED with camera, connector, left microphone and the label about 3.3 volts. This 10 pins connector has 9 wires and the first 4 wires are for the camera. I tried to use USB port as with all web cameras, but they was not starting and I was getting message that USB device is not recognized. And I started to think that I destroyed web camera and I gave up for a little bit. But later, after some search on the internet, I find out that if I will add one diode, like this one, I solder it to the 5 volt wire and web camera will be recognized. This microphone module is very small. These microphones on this compact PCB are not traditional analog microphones. And these wires are not analog outputs. These are MEMS digital microphones with I2S output. After some search on the internet, I found an article and project on GitHub on how to use Raspberry Pi Pico with digital I2S microphones. I compiled code and uploaded this file to Raspberry Pi Pico and I soldered 5 wires from the digital microphone. I also soldered the USB cable to the Pico to reduce size because I wanted to create symmetrical 3D model for the case. USB cables will go out at the bottom and 3 holes for the camera and microphones with this holder to keep parts of the cylinder together. Parts are printed. I printed different colors. Before assembly, I isolated wires with the tape. The camera module will be in the front part, Raspberry Pi Pico in the rear part, and the holder. Here is the black with orange. Orange black looks good as well. And this is a gray with green. And here is USB camera with USB microphone with long cables. Let's make some testing. USB cables to this dongle. Okay, let's test this one. Testing, testing, one, two, three. Testing, testing, one, two, three. And now let's test black one. Testing, testing, one, two, three. This order works. Wireless colors are meaningless. I tried several camera modules and the colors were different. Only pins order works. So now I know how I can use this module with this microphone and camera. And this is what I needed for my next project. But for now, here they are. Bye.